Well water treatment is specialized in manufacturing, pumping, purification systems for every kind of surface water from lake, river, pond without previous decantation. When an emergency situation occurs, because of a civil war or a natural disaster, clean water is always urgently needed to prevent epidemics such as cholera or dysentery from spreading among refugees and displaced or resident population. Therefore, urgent action and fast response are essential. Water is often available in situ but needs to be purified before it can be consumed. The uniqueness of the design is that it combines all four major steps required to provide clean water, pumping, purification, storage and distribution. Based on these observations, WWT decided to develop a fully self-contained water purification unit that could combine the four aforementioned process and would be appropriate for field use. That is, it would be mobile, sturdy, and easy to use and to maintain. Our purification units are already employed by NGO, humanitarian organization, governments, and working in many countries. These stations offer hygiene and health conditions to population in accordance with the rules and recommendations of the World Health Organization. The water kit components can be fully installed and operational within six hours and no special skills are required. It is supplied with consumables for at least 12 months of use. Only gas oil is needed. The water purification components Sand filter and the chlorine dosing units have no moving parts, consequently no wear. This means that water can be immediately provided once the equipment arrives on the site and is set up. This would not be the case if separate packs were used, one for the piping, one for the purification, one for the storage and one for the distribution of water. With individual packs, there is always the risk of split delivery, meaning that because one pack is missing, the other one could not be used. Composition of the unit There are two possible options. The on-skit option enables the water disinfecting unit to be completely self-sufficient and transportable on flatbed of lorries or can be laid directly on the ground. This is for fixed installation, adapted to provide water in the insulated villages. Capacity from 2 to 100 cubic meter per hour. The on-trailer option. The trailer is designed for off-road application and can be towed by any four-wheel drive vehicle available. This solution is ideal to ensure transportation of the unit to different operating sites. All our unit comprises a diesel-driven centrifugal pump, a primary sand filter, a secondary carbon filter, a chlorine dosing unit, a flocculation kit, one turbidity reduction kit with its turbidity tube, pipes for the connection. On demand, our trailer or skid can be equipped with cylindrical water tank, water tower, water tap stand, submersible pump or electrical motor pump, and electrical power plant. Installation of the well tube in the middle of a still water area. Flocculation. We have finalized two types of tablets, comprised both coagulant and flocculant. The WW BO966 tablet is adapted to treat water with composites such as plants decomposition, algae. The other WW ARG988 is to be used on a clayish water. In this demonstration, we use the WW BO tablet because 
the color of the water is green. Now we proceed with the sample of water in the turbidity tube. Crumble a part of one tablet WWBU966 in the tube filled with the water to treat. Shake well the tube during several minutes to dissolve the tablet in the water. We observe the coagulation and flocculation at the bottom of the tube. Coupling procedure. Installation of the blue flexible pipe from the river to the primary filter. Coupling the yellow inlet. Coupling between the two filters with the black color. The red color coupling is for the outlet of the dirty water. Chlorination procedure. Put three tablets of calcium hypochlorite in the chlorinator. After 30 minutes of the running of the unit, we proceed to a chlorine analysis test. Adjust the chlorination injection. Thanks to the graduated roller situated on the side of the chlorinator to obtain a valve of plus or negative 1 ppm. Primary filtration. Do not forget to stop the motor pump before handling of the multi-part valves. The primary and secondary filter must be on the filtration position. During the filtration, if the pressure on the manometer is up to 8 bars, activate the backwash procedure. Backwash procedure. On the primary filter, the multi-part valve must be on the backwash position. The secondary filter always stay on the filtration position. Stop the backwash after 5 minutes when the turbidity gauge becomes translucent. Priming the motor pump. Do not forget to put oil and gas oil before starting. Secondary filtration. The position of the valve is the same as the primary filtration but without backwash. Stocking. Now we can fill in the flexible water tank with drinking water, then we can stop the motor pump. Distribution. To this water tank, we connect to tap stand. Now you can enjoy our clean water.